Hello viewers, here is a Sentry boombox, if you can even call it that. I found this in the bathroom vanity. It's probably been there for 10 plus years. And I figured we should do a video on it and see if it stinks or if it actually has reasonable quality to it. I can only imagine it stinks, but I've been surprised before, so perhaps... Uh, this is okay. I don't know. Let's see if we have a model number here. MBBRC Radio with Clock. And I guess that would be the clock, which is, I guess, what remains of the clock. Now, I find it hard to believe that the batteries, if there are any in this thing, are still good after so many years, but there must be something keeping that time. So let's see what kind of batteries we have in here. Ah, we have a lovely uh, leaking freak show. Okay. Ah, I wasn't expecting that. Well, I guess I should have because... We all know how well these batteries work after they've been sitting for a long period of time. Well, let's see if I can get this out without making too much of a mess. Oh wow, this actually takes a lot of batteries. That one looks to be okay. Oh, it takes four batteries. Alright, well, I'm going to have to pause the video and clean this out because I don't want to put batteries that are usable inside a corroded uh, box. The leaking freak show must have been in its early stages because it cleaned out very easily. So I've got some nickel metal hydride batteries we're going to put in now. Well, I can see we're going to have an issue here. These are not uh, sitting in there all the way back. And I don't know how we're going to get the cover on with it like that. Oh, I guess it just goes on anyways. Okay. Alright, let's turn... Let's see, we got an antenna. Turn this on. I have my station set up, we'll, we'll tune it in here. more volume out of this transmitter here. That's all the way up. It's not very loud. So quiet. I don't think that's how it's supposed to be. Well, hmm. so that's all the volume I can get out of it. Um, it's not very loud at all. Now, obviously, there's no low end, 
to the sound, but what's there isn't actually all that bad. Okay, I'm going to turn off my transmitter here and see if we can receive any other uh, stations because something's weird about the way this is tuning in. The tuning just is not very good. I can't really get it to tune anything in. Okay, I like to tune that in a little bit. A lot louder than that. See if it'll tune anything else. Not really, let's see if we get anything on the AM band. There's something there a little bit. Alright, well I can't really get to pick up anything um, on the air. And when I plug in my transmitter over here, it seems to just pick it up all of the entire uh, band. It's much louder than it was before. Maybe the, the tuning mechanism in here either just isn't very good or it's labeled wrong because my transmitter is free is frequencing. It's transmitting at hundred and one meg or hundred point one megahertz. Um, and this is just over an I guess it's not too far off.
Well, I don't know. It's not the greatest. Um, admittedly, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. Would I ever use this? Probably not. Um, but I guess there is some situations where the, the small size would be nice. Um, I don't know what was wrong with it when we first started, but now the volume seems to be more reasonable. Well, anyways, uh, there's that. Probably going to put this back in the bathroom vanity and, and never use it for another 10 years, but um, at least now it's had its time on the video.